Hi everyone, it's CJ, and I wanted to share with you some happy mail. This piece that you're looking at right here is from Lynn Hughes, and basically we have a, a group over on Facebook. It's called the uh, Trashy Junk Journal uh, that Rosemary uh, Morris had put together. And we had a swap in which we were to send each other, oh gosh, I think it was like oh, 10 or 12 items that were considered trashy pieces of, oh, I, I kind of call it like ephemera, uh, but I know others just call it trashy trashy because it could be thrown away, that was actually from your area. Well, this is what I received from Lynn, and it just it blew me away. She put it into a journal form. I mean, is this not cool or what? Um, I absolutely love the way she has this painted paper on here. And this ribbon pulls it all together. She's got it tied together. Just really, really love this. And not only that, this is a, a receipt for something she had purchased with, well basically it doesn't have any personal information on it, but I save these and have them in a folder and on the back I will many times stamp off things uh, and just use it for other things, but that is great, so I'm glad she included that. But it is all based around this, this it looks like one of these books that are flyers that you can get in the mail. And it, it's just very informational. Sometimes it tells a story. Sometimes it's uh, historical. But going through here, it is just really wonderful. Also, she included little notes about different things. In this case, it's showing a map. And it's just, it says, During the Civil War, many people crossed the shallow area of the Tennessee River to get away from the fighting. I mean, that is so cool. Okay, I'm going a little further, and I'm not sure what kind of paper this is, but I really, really love this. Maybe it's from a, a sack or something. And then here she tells a story about, I don't know if you can see this, it's a bag of chips, see there? And she tells this little story about... It says, when I was growing up, every Sunday afternoon we had to listen to the Coach Bear Bryant and Shrug Jordan tell about their football team. They were met by Golden Flakes potato chips. I didn't know there were any other potato chips around for a long time. Ha! Huh. That is just such a cool thing to include. Okay, and then also, let's be careful here, we have a sack that she has inserted, and inside the sack, there's like a brochure, this is Ivy Garden, and then she has these wonderful pieces of yardage, it's bias tape that she has in there, I mean, they are just really nice. Okay. And then the Ivy Garden looks like a place that you might want to go and visit. Also, um, Horse Breeders Association information. Okay, I'll put those back in there in just a moment. We also have, it looks like a headlines from the Valley Planet. looks like a flyer that we would probably get in the newspaper. And then this is um, it's an invitation for uh, Thanksgiving to all the residents. And this is so different. I've never seen anything like this. It says a very old game card. That is just super cool. <laughs> and then we're here we have part of our book again. 
Okay, and it says up here, University of North Alabama, Florence, Alabama. And it just talks a lot about this choir and uh, parishioners and just very, very interesting. Okay. Alright, and then here it's W.C. Harding Festival, Florence, Alabama. Another musical inspired bits of information. And then on this one it says, uh, Muscle Shoals recording. Many, many groups got their start here. Okay, and then this looks like another part of the paper. This is uh, talking about different places to eat. Best restaurant. Best dining, best Asian. And this folds out a little bit so you can see the other side. And then this, and cute pancakes. <laughs> Pancake there. And this is the back side of those potato chips, golden flakes. And the other side of this paper. I'm wondering if that was from a bag. That's really cool. Other part of the map, and then the back part of the journal. Okay, I thought I would just share that with you. Thank you so much, Lynn. I really love it, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Have a great day, everyone. Bye bye.